guys so today i'm in newark new jersey and i have to admit that this is not my favorite city to commute into new york but i'm gonna have to suck it up and just go because for the last couple months i have been trying to go to this exhibition of taylor swift at the museum of art and design i believe it's called storyteller taylor swift and don't quote me on this but i believe it started sometime last year in august and eventually they extended it through March 24th. And I'm so happy they did because I, like I said, I have been trying and no luck. So today, finally, I'm gonna get to go to this thing that I've been wanting to go to. I can't really tell you all that's there because I've been clicking away from people's posts so that I don't see anything. So, you know, I can take it all in when I'm there. And yeah, after that, I'm going to do some other Taylor Swift related things. So I hope that's something that interests you. Um, and yeah, I'm going to go and commute into New York City to see some Taylor Swift. <laughs> hope you're excited. So I made it into the city and I'm right in front of the museum right now. And to my surprise, Taylor Swift is like plastered all over the building and I'm loving it. So I'm gonna show you guys the building from the inside. I already bought a ticket like two weeks ago so I don't have to do that. And my slot is for 3 p.m. and it's currently like 2.40ish. Um, yeah, 2.40. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna show you guys the building. and. So you can see all the stuff that they have in display here for her. So as you can see, like her name is everywhere. It's just so cool. And they have these little like Taylor Swift storyteller on view. So exciting. And I'll show you guys the front over here. Peekaboo. Okay. Just want to make sure I'm not in anybody's way. And then there she is up there. Yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and go inside in a little bit. Just wanted to peek through the outside first. So cool. All right, so I just checked in and immediately she told me to come upstairs. And as you can see, look at that. <laughs> so cool. Nice. Look at that. Taylor Swift. All right, her music is playing, so this is gonna be an issue. Costumes here. Here's the all too well lyrics right there. So cool. So her music has been playing, so I'm going to have to mute a lot of the video. Okay, and this is from, oh, it's from Evermore, from the Willow music video in 2020. Oh. I do remember that one, so it's so cool. Let's see what we got here. We got Lover, 
bracelet and necklaces by Versace from You Need to Calm Down and Lover performances during the MTV Music Awards in Newark, New Jersey. Wow, that's so pretty. Wow. Reputation over here, hand jewelry and necklace by Gucci from the Look What You Made Me Do music video. Oh wow, that is beautiful. There goes the music again. Wow. And then here's a lot of her costumes. Wow, so we have Reputation 2017, we music video. So cool. <laughs> Mask. I have to see this one. It's a little harder to see. Let me back up a little bit. kind of harder to see. This is from 1989, Houston Blazer. performance in World Tour. That's this one here. Oh, the lighting is terrible to get these. And then we have um, 1989, Custom cheerleader ensemble from Shake It Off music video. Oh, cool. Oh my god, look. The shoes. Oh my god, that is so cool. And then, oh my god, look at this one. That's from. Also from Shake It Off. Music video. Uh, trying to get it to focus. There we go. Oh. Sorry, it's getting harder to uh, get it to focus. Ah, oh, there's a. Uh, and then we got this is one. Custom lowering. Okay, I did that one already. Oh, from Out of the Woods performance. 1989 World Tour 2015. Wow. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. Wow. So pretty. This is from Dick Clark's New Year's Eve Rockin' Eve with Ryan Seacrest performance in 2015. There's the shoes. So pretty. Anyways, it's kind of hard to get them all, but there's that. I just noticed the little details here. The heart and it says Taylor right up there. Oh, look how cool. 
Doug Taylor. That's so cool. Oh look, they're playing all too well right here. Oh my gosh, look at this. So cool, and this is a, um, let's see. Came to with Benjamin Button. I'm a music video lover. Oh yeah. And the guitar by Gibson, Taylor Swift, Neon Sign. On Cornelia Street and the Mayor performs this during the City of Love concert in Paris. So yeah, this right here. Oh, sorry. <laughs>
right here. Oh, there so cool. All right, well, that was totally worth the expense of Uber. <laughs> so basically, this was kind of like the same thing that I experienced in Nashville. I don't know if you guys have seen that video, but it was like the same thing. A lot of her costumes, wardrobe, shoes, jewelry from music videos and performances. So that was really cool. Look how pretty this is. All right, well, that was totally worth the expensive Uber for sure. Hope you guys like that too. All right, let's see where I can go next. So cool. And they're actually going inside right now. Oh my god, so cool. I wish I could go. <laughs> yeah, look. There's even audiences rules right here. No phones allowed in the theater before or during after taping. Ah, oh, boring. Anyways, there it is one more time. Alright, we're heading into Times Square. How cool is this thing? so cool. Is this part of the restaurant or something? That's so cool. Well, we're almost at time. Well, I guess we can say we're in Times Square now. Oh, look, the advertising roadhouse. What is this? Croissants. Look at that huge croissant. Vespas out here. Just gotta check it out. Look at these cute little Vespas. It's cute. Huh. But this place is delicious. All right. Here we go. Has anyone seen this show? I'm guessing it's good. Moving. So because this is a Taylor Swift video, I'm hoping to see her face on one of these um, big billboards since her heiress tour movie is premiering on Disney's Plus, Disney Plus, sorry. And she's been um, talking about it every morning on Good Morning America. So, Good Morning America, I know films somewhere over here. So, that's what I'm looking for. All right, so there's Good Morning America Studios. You can see it right there. And we'll see if uh, Taylor pops up over there. There it is, I see it. Just kind of chilling here in the corner. Oh, I saw it for a minute there. Okay, so for like a minute, I was late. Taylor Swift came on screen, and it was the countdown to the Disney Plus premiere of the Eras Tour film. So I'm gonna wait a little while longer and see if it pops up again, okay? <laughs> Dang it, I was on my way somewhere else and then I saw it popped up. I was like, come on. I have been waiting here, you guys, forever. And she has not popped up again. I think I'm just gonna leave. I got a little bit of it. Um, but yeah, it has not popped up again. It's so annoying. All right, so I moved locations and they're all, they're also promoting the Ayers tour film right here. So I'm going to wait for it. There she is. So exciting. <laughs> there she is. Yeah. <laughs> so cool. I, I have been walking for nearly 45 minutes. My feet are killing me, but I am soon approaching Cornelia Street. I am four minutes away. 
I'm so excited to be there. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's one of these right here. Let me cross the street because I'm pretty sure where these girls are. It's where it is. But we're here. Yeah, I think this is it right here. Cornelia Street. Oh, they're doing a video. I love it. Oh, yeah, it's right there. It's right there. Oh my god, I love it. Oh my god, I didn't picture this street to look like this. Look at this. It's like. Just a regular street, but let's get closer. There it is. Oh my God, there it is. It's Taylor Swift and they're making a video too. Oh my God, I love it. <laughs> I'm literally standing right at 23 Cornelia Street. I know that I'm here now, but I'm gonna tell you guys one thing. I will never walk Cornelia Street again. <gasps> Oh, so cool. <laughs> I wanted to set up my, uh, what do you call it, tripod, but I didn't realize the street was this, like, close to the building, like, these, and the cars keep coming, so I don't want to, I don't think it'd be a good idea to do that, but we're here at Cornelia Street. <laughs> and I hope I never lose you, hope it never ends. I'll never walk Cornelia Street again. <laughs> All right, we're heading to another spot now. Um, it has to do with Taylor Swift, which is her studio, one of the studios that she goes to often. All right, guys, so now I've arrived at another location, and this is Electric Lady Studios. This is a studio that you have seen Taylor Swift in the past couple months coming in and out of to record some music. So it's pretty cool. <laughs> Let me show you guys. So it's that building right there. Um, I don't remember the the angles that you see a lot. I don't know if they were from this side. I'll just do both sides, but I feel like you see her coming in a lot this way and the other way. I don't know, to be honest with you, but that is the building right there. Um, you can see right over here where it says um, Electric Lady Studios. I don't know if there's another way to get in, but... Oh, yeah, right here. So, it's actually here. So, yeah. It's actually right here. Electric Lady Studios. So, maybe this is the door that you see her coming in and out of. Not over there. So cool. So, yeah. I guess right here, so... I would have to find pictures. So, I found one picture of her coming out of this door right here. Um, and you can clearly see the name Electric Lady Studios. Oh, hi! <laughs> Can't with these people. Um, but I guess this is the angle that you get mostly of her coming in and out of the store here. So freaking cool! Look, I'm in Washington Square. You probably recognize that from Ghostbusters. All right. Gotta keep going. That is a better view of it. So I have arrived at my last stop of the day. This is Housing Works Bookstore. This is where they filmed the All Too Well music video. Well, the last part of the music video. Right in here inside this bookstore. So let's go and check it out. There it is. Yeah. All right, they're about to close within an hour. So let's go. Here's the bookstore where they filmed the, the music video. I believe she would have been standing like over there somewhere. This place is so cool and they have like clothes too that you can buy. There's a bar over there. And, and of course books. Such a cool spot. So I think this is the angle right here. As you can see this pole right here. She would have been standing right there in the middle. Oh my God, so cool. I found a really cute purse. I like it. I'm gonna have to get it. Yeah. 
such a cute spot. So I, ju I was just asking, so you're a temp here? Yeah. Um, I was asking her where they filmed the video and she's like, I have a picture of Taylor Swift, <laughs> look at this. But it was actually filmed right over here. I think I was mentioning that it was over there, but it's actually right here. And it was taken from above, right? Yeah. Yeah. So cool, thank you so much. Yeah, of course. Okay, so the shot is actually right here. I don't know why I thought it was over there. And I knew that it didn't look familiar when I was taking it, but yeah, the shot is actually right here. And it was probably more from this side over here, because you can see the register over there. But yeah, this would be more the shot. So cool. All right, guys, so I just left the bookstore. That was awesome. I ended up getting a book. I didn't think I would get a book, but I bought a scarf because how fitting, right? Um, I'll show it to you guys maybe later. All right, guys, I'm back at the hotel and let me tell you how happy I am to be back because my feet are killing me. Oh, I was trying my best to do the cheapest route, the safest route, and I just did not feel like taking the subway today, especially by myself. So what I did was that I Ubered to the museum and then because that Uber ride was so expensive, I was like, you know what, I'll just walk all the other, uh, all the other spots and oh my God, my feet feel like they're going to fall off. Like the, the next stop from the museum to the apartment, that was a 45 minute walk. And then from there it, it gradually got better, but I think to the very last spot was another 20 minute walk. So it was just like nonstop all day. And either way, I'm so happy that I finally got to that museum and I got to see her beautiful wardrobe that she's worn over the years. And recently, a lot of them were very recent, especially the midnight stuff that was so beautiful. Like, man. <laughs> I took my tripod with me to be able to be in the videos more often and, you know, get good pictures of myself in front of stuff. And I didn't even use it once, but it is what it is. Anyways, enough chit chat. So at the museum, they had a couple um, of stuff. They didn't have too many. It looks like they were sold out, but I ended up getting just this. It's like, I believe this is just a postcard or or is it just a I don't know I'm guessing it's just some kind of card you know that you can send out to someone because I see an envelope but either way I wanted to take something away with me from the museum because that was very special and I'm so glad I went <clears throat> so I got that and then at the bookstore I got a movie, The Prince's Diaries, <laughs> only because I've never, I've never owned this movie and it was really cheap. So I bought a book. <clears throat> I don't think you guys care. I got this, it's called A Holly Jolly Ever After. I don't know, the title kind of caught my attention and I love the graphics on this. So I'm like, you know what? I haven't read a book in a while, so. I got it and also the price was right. This was only $12. So I'm like, that's pretty good. And then because I was at the location where they film all too well music video, I bought myself a scarf. Like, right? Like you can't, you cannot. And they had so many scarves. And even though they didn't have a red one, that would have been perfect. I got this one because it kind of reminds me of folklore, right? Kind of like, or Evermore. I think it's more like Evermore. Yeah, Evermore. It's just so pretty. So, and this was only, how much was this? $12? Yeah, $12. So, not bad. Um, and then, I gotta say that that was so sweet when I was asking. I'm so glad that I asked that, that girl about um, <clears throat> what spot was Taylor Swift standing on because she was so sweet and she said that I made her day because she was a temp and she wasn't even supposed to be there today and she's like now I'm so glad that I went I ended up asking her if she wanted a friendship bracelet because I'm 
I, I wore a few of them and she took my um, reputation one. She said that she's a reputation girly. And yeah, you guys saw the picture of her and Taylor Swift. Like, that's so awesome that she got to meet her. But yeah, I guess that's it. So I really hope that this video finds all my Swifties out there. And I hope that you guys like this video. And for those of you that are not a Swifty and also have liked this video, thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for all the likes and the comments. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs> My bag just fell. <laughs>